Welcome back. One of the biggest authors in the young adult genre is back with a new book. Holly Jackson, the creator behind The Good Girl's Guide to Murder, has released a new title. Oh. Here it is. Here it is here. <laughs> the reappearance of Rachel Price is about the making of a true crime documentary and centers around a young woman named Belle who was roped into participating in it. And Holly is here to tell us more. Welcome to The Morning Show. Thank you for having me. Welcome to Canada. I know. I'm very <laughs> tired. I don't even know what time zone I'm in, but I'm very happy to be here. Well, that makes for a better interview. Yeah, exactly. I might give away all my secrets. <laughs> well, uh, I want to hear them. And let's begin with the inspiration behind this because as we just mentioned main character's bell mm -hmm. roped into this documentary which is about the disappearance of her mother 16, yeah, 16 years, years prior yeah, yeah 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 where do you come up with this so actually this one was kind of an interesting genesis because the thing that came first was the title so i was walking my dog one day and i was listening to a true crime podcast which is kind of my natural state of being because murder soothes me. Um, so I was walking the dog, listening to a podcast, and I just had an idle thought that a lot of that true crime media is called the disappearance of blank blank. And I just had a very small thought, like, what if you flip reversed that to the reappearance of blank blank? And then I quickly filled in the name because I wanted some nice alliteration. So I came back from that walk with the full title, and then I just had to do the easy job of writing a whole book to fit the title. <laughs> Bish bash oh bosh. I, I, I love hearing about authors' uh, journeys because everyone seems to be different, but that is a very uh, fantastic story. Let's talk about yeah. the big twist in this uh, story of yours is that her mother, Rachel, reappears while the documentary is filming. So exactly. what did you uh, enjoy most in writing that part of the story? So, so that bit's not a spoiler because it's in the title, is what right. I, I like to say. And, and you won't believe this, guys. There's a woman called Rachel Price, and get this, she reappears at some point. Um, so, yeah, they're filming. We have a British film crew over filming a true crime documentary. Um, and our main character, Belle, is not happy about that at all because she's lived her whole life in the shadow of her mum's disappearance. You know, everyone's like, oh my God, you're Rachel Price's daughter. So she's not happy with this documentary. And then partway through filming, Rachel reappears. And then of course, Belle is not happy about that at all. And she has a lot of trust issues because her mum's got a story about where she's been for the last 16 years. But Belle's not sure that she can trust what she's saying. So she decides to start digging in and doing her own investigation into where Rachel Price may really have been for the last 16 years mm. so we have lots of secrets twists and turns some some tense family dynamics it, you know, it was a fun one to write right the family mm. dynamics yeah. uh, the trust issues the familiar so many trust issues yeah if you read any of my books you should have trust issues <laughs> <laughs> if you don't already. Mm. Um, but the yes, the family dynamic, mm. really at the core of this, right? Yes. And, and the relationships uh, Belle has with her mother, mm -hmm. with her cousin, with, with a few people in the yeah. family. Um, it's very it, much it's, a, a keep it in the family kind of book, yeah. Uh, and that is essential to this, is mm. it not? Yeah, well, I... The reason I did that was I find in a lot of YA books, and I'm guilty of it as well, often we like to get rid of the parents because they, um, they get in the way of the teenage antics, you know, if they're there with their parental responsibility. So often we find reasons to push them to the sidelines. And I wanted to really, like, embrace... Obviously, every teenager has to spend a lot of time with their parental figures. Um, and I really wanted to look into that as, as a story that we don't see a lot in this, in this area. When I was first telling my editors about it, I kind of pitched it as like, why a gone girl in reverse? I don't know if it quite reaches that because Gillian Flynn is obviously a genius, but I'm just going to keep saying it. Hey, that's a great pitch. Yeah. <laughs> Say it enough and it'll stick. Okay, that's the reappearance of Rachel Price. And before we let you go, we do want to ask you about the success of The Good Girl's Guide to Murder. Um, congratulations yeah. on that, by the way. Over a million copies have been sold worldwide. And we now hear there's even a TV adaptation in the works. Can you tell us about that? Very much in the works. In, f in fact, we're, we're finished. We're in post-production. Uh, it will air on the BBC in the UK in July. And it will be everywhere else at a mysterious time on a mysterious network that I'm not allowed to tell you yet because I'll get in big trouble. I know it. I'm saying it in my head right now. So if anyone can read eyeballs, then you know. Um, that was 
a very stressful process, but very fun, obviously. And yeah, I got to go to set maybe two days every week and I was involved in the scripting process, the casting. So yeah, I've been sticking my nose in everywhere. I don't know if they wanted me to, but um, I was there. That must be surreal. It was weird, yeah. When I walked into the table read for the first time, and it was like the first time seeing all the actors together, it was a bit of a moment of like, hold on, this is real. And all these people came from my head. I know, wow. it, was, it, was, it was fun though. Just yeah. like the page is coming to life. I know, yeah, it is fun and I, I'm excited. I mean, I've already seen it a few times, but I'm excited for everybody else to watch it eventually. Eventually, on mm. a mysterious network. Coming some... soon-ish. <laughs> <laughs> well, such a pleasure. In the meantime, the reappearance of Rachel Price is available now everywhere books are sold. Holly, thank you for stopping by. Thank you by. so much for having me. Thank Our you. Pleasure.